guess this could be for both of you guys. Just I think we've talked to you a bunch of times over the last couple of months, and you guys have said it would feel good to finally get this win. Just you know, what does it, I guess, feel like to just kind of get back in the win column? Um, it just does uh, stay in the course. Um, of course, we went on that, that long losing streak, and us coming out tonight with the energy and the preparation that it took for us um, the, these last two days, um, we took it to heart. And we came out with the mindset that um, no matter no matter what, we're going to get this win. And uh, credit to my teammates, they was locked in today. Um, and we broke, broke the streak. Um, I think we just, you know, we locked in. Um, it was a different type of energy in the shoot around and practice this week. But um, I'll say this, my team, we never really ever laid down ever. So, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we couldn't get any lucky ones, you know what I'm saying? I feel like this one, we grinded it out, and we deserve to win this one. But it's hard when you can't get to those 50-50 games and certain situations don't go your way. But um, I just want to, you know, give kudos to my team, my coaches, because um, it's easy to lay down right now, and we didn't do that. KJ, um, I think you all had a one-point lead, and then you scored 20 of the next the team's next 33 points. What what kind of like did you just feel it like you were getting you were getting hot and then just get me the ball? Was it kind of like that? And also Adam, how much fun was it watching him kind of take over the game at that point? Um, with me uh, scoring those 20 of our next 33, um, just credit to my teammates for finding me. Um, and my, also the coaches uh, drawing up plays for me to get wide open shots, um, looking at the defense because there's a lot of space out there. Um, and it, it was just something that, that we, uh, we got to attack. Uh, of course, if you see a lot of space, um, why not attack it? Um, and credit to my teammates, they, they found me in the open spots, and I, kn I knocked them down. Um, I think he hit one. It was from far out, and I was like, yeah, this man is, is going crazy. Um, I mean, I, I expect him to do that, though. I've seen him do it. Um, the way they were covering our action, I'm like, he's just <laughs> he's gonna keep knocking it down. Y'all better do something different. And they, I mean, they didn't really do anything different. It was kind of like when Liam, I think Liam had hit like two or three, and then KJ hit like two. I was like, oh yeah, KJ's gonna win this matchup because I I feel like KJ, if you talk about fours and fives that can shoot the ball, he's like one of the best out there. So um, he got hot, and I feel like the whole team was just. You know, we were. It was just fun because we got a win, and he, you know, what I'm saying, carried us today. It was just fun to have that happen. Just for both players, what do you think finally got you over the hump tonight? I mean, was it the fact you, y'all guarded from the beginning to end, and there were no open shots for Vandy, or was it the fact y'all had no prolonged cold shooting streaks? I mean, y'all were, you, you didn't, you didn't miss much. Um, I think, I think we did a, a great job. Um, they run a lot of pistol action. We kind of had that covered. Um, uh, what's their point guard? Ezra. Man, he fast. Um, but like I said, they, they, they got their point guard, Ezra. He's only shot two threes on the year. Then they got a lot of shooters, <laughs> a lot of shooters. Even Liam can shoot it. Um, but I think on the defensive end, you know what I'm saying, when you get stops like that, we had uh, like we had uh, four possessions in – well, four times in the first half, well, we got three stops in a row. So, you know, that's going to ignite your offense e either way it go. And we knocked down a couple shots. KJ got us going. Um, I got to the free throw line. I got downhill a little bit. So it was just good to have everybody. I mean, it was, it was it was down the line. Like, I looked up, and I was like, I seen, like, three or four people with two assists, three or four people with three, four-plus rebounds. So, you know, when you have a game like that where everybody's pitching in here and there, you're bound to get a win. Yeah, I mean, it was kind of a tale of two halves. You know, the first half, you guys really were shooting it well from the perimeter, and the second half, you really kind of drove it in and got to the free throw line a lot. Just um, what was the, I guess, message at halftime? Was that a, a point of emphasis for you guys to try to attack the rim on this guy, on this team? Um, Basically, uh, yeah, because like I said before, like there was a lot of open space, especially on ball screens. Um, bigs, they, they bigs was in drop coverage, and there was a lot of open space in, in the uh, middle of the paint. So we just attacked that, and then um, like once they started to help on that, then that's when we got like those easy threes, and then they they went back to the other defense. We got easy easy points in the paint, so we just tried to to uh, switch it up a little bit, you know, so so we can just get uh, easy buckets.
Adam, are you kind of superstitious? The uh, hair, maybe the hair did it today. Different, different hair. I don't know. I practiced yesterday with a headband, and I kind of liked it, so I was like, let's do it. <laughs> Switch it up a little bit. It kind of made me feel a little different. So, um, I think I played a little different today. Uh, I didn't settle. Um, normally, like I do, I got downhill, got to the free throw line, got some layups, and uh, I mean, I feel good. Let's rock with the next game too. Uh, this is for KJ. Um, that last shot in particular was crucial. Um, gave gave the gave the Tigers the lead with uh, or the three possession lead with under Menant. Now, uh, what was going through your mind throughout that shot? Are oh, you talking that three? Yeah. Um, I just seen that it was like uh, three or four seconds on the clock, so it, no matter what, I had to shoot it. But I I just had the instinct to shoot it because most of the time the big he was already in the paint so why not just shoot it and I was I already had the high hand and once I shot it, I already knew it was, it was good so I just ran down court and um just it's just a, a instinct of me and my teammates um to get me open and um uh, kudos to them killer